That's his coach, right? He's going to translate for you. He speaks English. He's going to translate. Okay, perfect. Who gives? Uh, you were fighting for the IBF. You were fighting for the mandatory for Earl Spence. And now you're fighting on the WBC side. What happened? Uh, Jordani, you fought for the eliminatoria of the title of the for the IBF, and now you're fighting for the eliminatoria of the title of the for the WBC. What's going on and how do you feel? No, I feel happy. I'm very happy with the work that I'm doing. And we're the mandatory of the FIF. We're going to fight the Saturday to fight for the WBC. And I'm going to fight for the WBC. And I'm going to fight for the WBC. Uh, he feels really proud, he feels really, feel really happy, he feels honored to be in number one contender in the IBF and now he feels really proud and, and, and happy to be able to, to fight for the WBC Eliminator. He's ready to fight any champion that is, is on the top. He, he's a champion, he's training like a champ, so we're ready for anybody. Did you, did, did, did he call out Earl Spence? Cuando terminé en febrero pensé que iba a pelear en junio, eh, no se dio, él fue a pelear con un niño de 21 años, un desconocido, eh, yo he seguido peleando, voy a seguir compitiendo y yo estoy listo para el mejor peleador que esté disponible a mí. Por supuesto, we, we fight the, 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 you know, the elimination for the IBF, and we're number one contender, and of course we need to call out, you know, whoever is on the top, whoever has got the belt. And uh, if you if you're ready, he, we thought we wanna fight him in, in July. But he fight a, a young kid from Mexico that nobody knows him, and he's ready. He's ready to fight his friends. He's ready to fight whoever wins this Saturday. Whoever can give us the opportunity for the title, we're ready to fight. Now, Errol Bonham a great fighter, but he said as far as a mandatory challenge goes, he doesn't. He wants bigger names right now. Does he look at that as an insult? Espero digo que que si eras el mandatorio, pero que ahorita está buscando los los nombres que tienen bolsas que cómo sientes tú ese comentario de él, un poco insultante, un poco despectivo. Esta es su opinión. Yo soy el número 7 en toda la lista en todos los 147 de la liga. He peleado contra todo tipo de posición y si él piensa que va a terminar peleando y terminando esa nota la fama y hablando de legado, un chico de 21 años no va a ningún lado. He said that uh, he's, um, you know, he take it like it is, and uh, he's, um, he, wanted to, he wanted to fight Spence, but uh, if he's talking about legacy and become one of the greatest fighters in Texas and, and fight that kind of opponent, I don't think he's going to get far, but uh, you know, he's ready, he's, he, he's coming for a, you know, for a comeback, he got seven and more fights with his comeback now, so he's ready to fight him, you know, he's just willing to... Uh, we have to, to give us a chance and let's see who is the best man. Do you think Saturday? Oh. Can a win Saturday night just bring you one step closer to for Arrow to not avoid that and to take on the challenge? La pelea de sábado te pone un paso más cerca de Spence. Sí, es una buena pelea. Es una pelea con el número uno en Dolby C. Y veo terminar el sábado. Pero tenemos una gran pelea, pero espero terminar con un combat que tenga diferentes opciones. Yeah, yeah, definitely. You know, we we're gonna be uh, God willing, we will be in the position to be the number one on the story for WBC. And, and like you said, you know, it's 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 it's, it's just um, it's a matter of time to, to be open to anybody to, to fight they, for, for a title. They say everyone's ducking Earl Spence. Do you think Earl Spence ducks you? Dice que todo el mundo se agacha de Spence. Que si Spence se agacha de ti. Bueno, posiblemente no, no pienso que tenga miedo, pienso que es un gran peleador, eh, uno de los mejores campeones, pero sabe que conmigo es una pelea competitiva. competitiva, él no, cualquier campeón tiene que pelear fuerte conmigo y yo voy a hacer la competitiva para que sea. Dice que tiene respeto por Spence, es un gran fighter, y uh, no creo que tenga miedo, pero él sabe que es un hombre competitivo. You know, a tough guy, a tough in the 147 pounds. He's number seven on the list of the 47 pounders right now. And, you know, he's just willing, he's just willing to see who's the best man between uh, Spence and, uh, and Ugas. Who would you prefer, Sean Porter or Danny Garcia? I can't prefer it. No, it's a great fight. Buena peleador de los dos. Mucho respeto a los dos. Y pienso tener la oportunidad de yo tener una pelea después de sábado por uh, both of them are great fighters. You don't know, he, he, he wishes the best for both of them. He don't know who's going to win. But whoever wins and, and gets the title, if there's any opportunity to fight anybody there, we will fight them.
Gloriosa.